Hello everyone. Today I'm going to cook naimin curry uh, which is also called shear fish uh, with coconut and other ingredients. So these are the ingredients I'm going to add. I'm starting from the right side. The green color which is curry leaves, black pepper, fennel seeds, methi seeds, turmeric powder, chili powder and coriander powder this is fresh coconut grated today i took little bit onion tomato and one chili so to start i'm going to pour a little bit oil I'm going to add freshly grated coconut to it. Fry it in the oil for a few minutes. It don't need to be turned brown, uh, very light brown or like a you know, little bit heat over it, that's good enough. At this stage, um, I'm going to put other ingredients. I'm putting everything together. I'm going to fry again for a few more minutes. It depends on how you want. If you want it like you know more darker brown, you can wait until darker brown as well. Or it depends on you uh, how you want the taste of curry. But even uh, lighter version also tastes good. So at this stage, I really uh, get a very good flavor smell. So I'm going to add other ingredients, which is onion and tomato. And I'm going to fry this for a few more minutes. I'm going to stop at this stage. I don't want to fry more. I'm going to add this masala in a mixer jar. Since it's hot, I would say wait for a few minutes uh, until it cool down. Uh, when you turn on the mixie, because it will be the mixie when it is turned on, it will be hot, and both together it will be too hot. So I will wait for a few minutes. Add water and then grind it. I grinded the, in, all the ingredients together and it was like a paste right now. So as a prep, in an empty kadai, add the fish first. tamarind paste which I already had prepared so I'm going to add the tamarind paste in the fish and mix it now add the grinded paste Add some water uh, for more uh, liquid consistency. I had adding more water to it. Then put some salt and cook. So now I'm going to turn on the stove. I'm going to add a uh, serrano pepper. Uh, I took away all the seeds because um, I like less spicy. Uh, if I add serrano pepper, then it will be very hot. 
so i'm adding just only one without seeds and i'm adding the salt as well as needed you can add add the salt so cook for 15 minutes So now for garnishing, I'm going to add a little bit oil. In this, I'm going to add mustard seeds. Then I'm going to add two red chilies and then um, I'm going to add curry next I'm going to add onion wait for a few minutes so at this stage I am offing the stove so at this stage uh, I'm going to add the garnish So this curry is like uh, basically um, originated from my hometown. Um, my hometown, most of the uh, families uh, do in the similar way. Uh, and I changed a little bit, but mostly it's like my hometown, which is tip of in India, uh, southern part of the India. So thanks for watching and subscribe, like, and comment and your valuable suggestions are um, very welcome and thank you so much for watching